Hello everybody, Gypsy Joe Ramblings here. I am doing a Walmart Dollar Tree in Food City Hall. Um, got a few things at Walmart. Mainly my supplies came from Dollar Tree. Um, things I needed, things that I'm going to be working on. And then just three things that I got at Food City right now. Finally found one in Douglas. Um, anyway, starting off with, I bought some of this for Nick since he is making his own uh, things for a sa to sell to sell. <laughs> there we go for a sale. Um, he needs this, so I picked him up one of these, which was probably about four ninety five, I think. Um, that was at Walmart. I wanted originally a big, um, like industrial size type of glue gun, but I decided to stick with the smaller one. I wanted the Gorilla Glue sticks, but they are kind of spendy, so I just decided to buy this. It was cheap. It was probably about $4.95 also. Picked that up at Walmart, the mini glue gun pack. So, got that. I picked up some a tube of E6000, but I didn't realize it was the black kind, and I needed the clear kind. They did not have a big thing at Walmart of E6000, the clear uh, glue, so I got these mini ones for about uh, less than $4 at Walmart. Then I wanted some paint uh, markers. Um, and these were the only ones I found. They did have a couple. Each was like $3.97 each. I didn't feel like paying that much for it. These are super fine tip and fine tip. Um, but I can figure out how to use those in the way that I want to. And it is in, um, what is this one? Uh, this is gold, a gold color and a silver color. I had to find the metallic silver because uh, they had a lot of gray, and that was not what I was looking for. So, this was $1.97, this one was $1.97. Um, picked up the Mod Podge. I was trying to find the super gloss type kind of glue, but I settled for this kind because I have picked up lots of glue now, so I'm just going to settle with this and see how this works for the projects I want to do. Um, this was probably about four or five bucks at Walmart. Crazy prices. Um, picked up a set of scissors so I don't keep losing my scissors somehow at the rec hall where I live. Um, I think these should work fine for my um, uh, planners and my crafts. And I could throw one in our drawer here, my craft stuff here. And then if I go somewhere, take the other with me and put a tag on here that says friend does in case it ever gets lost and these were like 97 cents um then i needed some glitter but the walmart in douglas has changed a little bit they no longer have many glitters as a matter of fact they don't even have a book scrapping section really they have like a couple of booklets those thick ones for like $10.99, $5.99 of odds and ends, um, what do you call it, book, uh, book scrapping papers. Um, and so it'll be hard for me to find that. I'll probably have to go to Hobby Lobby for that. But this glitter right here was about three bucks. All this. And that I, to me is, that's spendy for glitter. But being as it's the season, it's the season to be spending a lot of money. Um, I just bought this uh, this one because it was the cheapest one they had with many different colors. So I bought that, and that was about three bucks. Stickers. The stickers they had there were mainly letter stickers. But um, for my planner, um, I plan to use these heart stickers to mark off maybe like a checklist. They're glitter, so I'm not sure if that will work or not. We shall see. These were 97 cents. Then for the name, I got these so I could put my name or other uh, quotes or something in there uh, if I don't write them myself. 
And so these were 97 cents. These were on sale for $1.50. I like to bake, and since I will be baking for Christmas, um, hopefully, if I can use the Rec Hall, um, um, what do you call it, uh, oven, if it's fixed, or if I can use it, then I will be baking there because we do not have an oven. I don't want to use the propane for our oven. So, anywho, I got these on sale for a buck fifty, and I thought they were really cute. So I'll be using those, and uh, maybe uh, for craft things for the sale, or just in my planner. I don't know. For $1.99, I got the Women's Day Christmas magazine with the free issue of Delish. And then for $4.99, I got the Better Homes and Gardens magazine because I, sorry, I get ideas and I love looking at their pictures and stuff like that. Not to mention reading, reading the... articles. <laughs> I am losing my mind. Sorry. <laughs> so that's all the stuff that I got at Walmart. All that. Let's get that out of the way because my next thing is going to be oops, sorry, quite full. Sorry, I'm showing you my bed. There. And that goes to Nick for his project. Now, oh, now for the next project, um, our haul was Dollar Tree. I got my um, sponges again from Dollar Tree because I use them for my dishes, which when I saw that reminded me I needed dish soap. So I got that. Uh, 99 cents. Dollar Tree. I got Nick needed uh, more duct tape, so I got him duct tape um, for his project or whatever he's planning to do. We're running out of spray for our bathroom, so I thought the cashmere woods would be a great spray to have on hand. Um, one of my projects is going to be using some of these tea lights, so I got two of them. Um, for my um, stickers and other things that I'm going to use for my planner, I bought one of these. I could also, because it's fairly thin, I think I can punch holes in here. Um, if I need to put them in a folder or something, maybe not, I'll just throw them into my craft thing. So I got that. Needed permanent markers. My mom found these, uh, multicolor, all different kinds of colors of the rainbow here, um, of the permanent markers. So I got that. Needed super glue. So I bought some of that. Um, I needed some eyeballs for a craft, so got some googly eyes. Um, needed the spoons mainly in this in a craft, so I grabbed just a package of these things. Um, Nick, my son, needs these for his project, so, um, I grabbed three different size paintbrushes for him. Um, needed toothpicks for glue and stuff, so I grabbed a package of toothpicks. Um, spells for Christmas things, so I grabbed a package of bells. Gonna need a ruler, grabbed a ruler. My bestie pointed out this glue so I grabbed some of that. I got plenty of glue now. Um, I grabbed some of these for a project I have. I'll be doing soon. Um, some of these for a project. So I grabbed some of those. These also I need for my planner, um, a project. So I grabbed some of those. Grabbed some glasses so I can see a little bit better when I'm doing things. And also I wanted a Christmassy looking one and I thought this came pretty gosh darn close. I grabbed, and this I was surprised to find at the Dollar Tree. I grabbed some tacky glue. 
Um, let's see what else. Um, I got a three pack of the patchouli smelling uh, Ed Hardy um, car fresheners. But I used them in our camper, but they're patchouli. And I was like, oh my god. So one of these might go to somebody. I'm not sure yet. And they smell good. They smell terrific. Um, let's see. I'm going to do my nails for Christmas. And I thought that was a really nice, cute, glittery thing. I'm going to be doing some pictures for my Facebook page. And I wanted to kind of look nice. And I also found these nail arts, which I can also use for other art too, not just my nails, but I thought those were really cute at the Dollar Tree. They're bows. So that was really cute. I needed highlighters, so I grabbed multicolor highlighters. Um, oh yes. Um, I thought this was neat, but these are already little like stickers. And they are jewel snowflakes, so that would be cute to use on projects that I'm going to be doing. Um, these, uh, I, I found some diamond wrap, wrap in silver, or clear, whichever you want to call it, for a project. And also in the gold color for a project. Um, always running out of pencil sharpeners. So I bought a two pack, which also has an eraser on each. Thought that would work really well for my scrapbooking. Um, let's see what else do I got over here? Oh, well, I've had these stickers before. I put them on jars that hold my spices, but I decided I wanted to get some for my planner. Then for Christmas, I decided to buy into the snowman snowflake theme. So I got some of those for my planner. Oh yes, and I plan to make cookies, so I had to get me the cookie sheet. So I got that. Now for my planner, it's the Boho Happy Planner. My niece is had surprised me with getting it for Christmas for me. So I decided that I would pick up some kind of what kind of reminds me of boho type things. Um, oh, and I also got these stickers for my planner. I thought they were dorbs, so I had to get that. Um, so let's see. I got these stickers and there's, whoops. <laughs> There's 32 of them, it looks like. That I'm going to use in my planner. Pens. That I'm going to use for my planner. I'm going to hook around my planner. These are just headbands. And because the planner that I'm getting doesn't have like an elastic hold it shut in case it gets too, gets too big or full. I bought these and I can use these any season, any time, in multi-purpose. And the colors are great. They all kind of go together. Um, I bought these for the outside of the planner. I'm going to fix up a little bit of the planner with the tassels. Um, Washi tape. Gotta have my owls. Ooh, come back here. Um, flowers. Cute little animals. Fruits. And some dots. And they all kind of go together. Kind of a theme going on there. I'm gonna wear this Christmas hat in my picture. Um, and for 
decorating up my presents that I make or whatever, I got this kind of wrapping paper. Remember, this is all at the Dollar Tree, so it's all a buck, plus your tax. But I thought that was pretty. It's like a tan, almost uh, shopping bag, grocery bag look. And then tissue paper. I love, 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 love this. I might actually use some of this in my book scrubbing or planner thing. And these for the tags. It all go together. Sorry about the glare or the shine or whatever. All that goes together. And then I got these two ribbons. Lace ribbon and Joy Merry Christmas ribbon. Gonna do stuff with the lace ribbon uh, probably for my planner and also decorating. Now that's all Dollar Tree stuff. Um, got so many crafts and stuff coming up and birthdays and so much stuff um, that I'm trying to make and take down the price of things. Now at Food City, a lot of people, you know, uh, a lot of people don't think uh, herbs and stuff or anything fancy, but I got this whole ginger and I plan to use this in crafts and some things I'm going to do. Love the smell. Reminds me of Christmas and stuff when it's also blended with um, cinnamon and clove and nutmeg, pumpkin pie spice. And, but I was surprised to find eucalyptus leaves at Food City. Love the smell of this and also plan to incorporate that into a few things that I have ideas for. And my bestie will probably get some of these. And I was surprised to find rosebuds. These make a very nice tea. It can be ground up into certain foods, salads, and also used in oils and um, art projects, you know, so I'll plan to use that too. So, it's got a light scent to it, but if you use rose oil or whatever, it will perk up for you. So, that's my haul. Everything right there. Need your lots of stuff. And all this is going to be used throughout the year. Used in crafting that is coming up. Also stay tuned for some crafts I plan to sell. I will take pictures of and prices of and show it to you. Um, also gifts to people. Just many, many things. My mind has... I had to take a notebook and write down different things on every page that I have coming up. So stay tuned. I hope you liked this haul. Um, be sure to check out, you know, your cheaper prices at Walmart, um, your cheaper prices at Food City, and definitely, definitely go to your local uh, Dollar Tree. Plenty of things for you to buy and and work with. So anyway. Like, subscribe, comment, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye, guys.